In this video, ESP32 is programmed as a WebSocket server where temperature and humidity from DHT22 sensor is displayed on an interactive web page designed using HTML, CSS, and JavaScript. A circuit diagram of the implemented system is shown here. DHT22 sensor is interfaced to pin 32 of the microcontroller and we have a push button connected to digital pin 23 and two LEDs connected to pins 2 and 4. When the temperature from the DHT22 sensor exceeds 25 Celsius, a message will appear on the web page prompting the user to turn on the fan and when the user presses the button the fan LED will turn on. When humidity from the sensor goes below 40%, a message appears on the web page prompting the user to turn on the humidifier. And when the user presses the humidifier button, the blue LED will turn on. When the push button is pressed, a warning message will appear on the web page. The web page is designed using HTML, CSS, and JavaScript. On the web page, we see temperature in Celsius and humidity in percentage. We also see graphical representation for temperature and humidity values in the form of bar graphs. We also see here messages coming from the server. So here we see that the message is fan on. So when the temperature exceeds uh, 25 Celsius we get this message so we click on the fan button in order to turn on the fan connected to the server and also here we have a message for the humidifier which says humidifier off but when the humidity level goes below 40 percent we get the message humidifier on so we click on the humidifier button to turn on the humidifier connected to the server. We also have a message here coming from the server which tells us that the status of the server is OK. Now when somebody on the server side presses the push button we can see here on the web page a message which says check server. And now for a quick demonstration, a message coming from the server which uh, tells us to turn on the fan. So we click on the fan button and we notice on the server side the red LED turns on indicating that the fan has been switched on. On the server side we press the push button and we see on the web page the message check server. Humidity level drops and we get a message from the server which says humidifier on. We click on the blue button and we note on the server side the blue LED turns on. The sketch is made of three parts. We have this INO file which contains the C code and we have this header file functions which contains the sub functions used in the sketch and we have this header file web page which uh, has the HTML, CSS, and JavaScript codes for the web page. Please refer to my previous videos to learn how to program ESP32 as a WebSocket server and how to design a web page. More ESP32 WebSocket projects will be presented in future videos. Thank you for watching.